Hey guys, Scott here. Um, I just thought I'd make a, a quick little video for my Facebook to kind of, I don't know, maybe clear up a lot of questions that I get. You know, I, I do mention guns and things on my Facebook from time to time occasionally. And because of that, I get emails, I get uh, messages in my inbox asking me questions about guns and things because they know I, I have a little bit of knowledge in this area. And I thought I would just maybe clear up in one swoop uh, some of those questions so we can just uh, head them off to the pass. One of the questions I get a lot is <clears throat> they, a guy will write in and he'll say, you know, I'm thinking about, you know, buying something for my wife. She works downtown or, you know, maybe uh, I'd like to get her a concealed carry weapon. And uh, that's certainly something to think about. And they want to know what would my recommendation be. So uh, I've got just a couple of things here. I you know, if it were my wife, that's what I tell them, if it were my wife, you know, and she was going to carry, say, a purse or something, what I would think about doing um, for concealed carry for my wife is I would strongly consider um, the Smith & Wesson 44 Magnum Model 29. This was the gun of Dirty Harry and will blow your head clean off. So if it were my loved one and my wife and she was going to carry a little something in her purse, I would just do something kind of like this and tuck. That's what, I mean, that's what I would do for my, if it were my wife. So, that, and that's a question I get a lot. So I hope that maybe cleared up that for you. Another one that I get a lot is like a really concerned son with, say, an elderly mother. They'll write in and they'll say, Scott, um, you know, my mom lives alone. She's 89 years old. I bought her Life Alert, and she lives in a bad neighborhood, and I just don't feel like that falling and I can't get up button around her neck is going to solve every problem she might run into. Scott, do you, would you recommend something for my elderly mother so that she feels a little safer at home by herself? And absolutely, I could recommend something. You know, I mean, 89, she's getting on up there. I would... I'd recommend a concealed weapon for her as well, and uh, I'd probably go Mini Uzi for my elderly uh, grandmother. Um, Mini Uzi, fully automatic, it will absolutely kill everybody in the room with no problem. 25 round magazines, very high rate of fire, and it's concealable. Get your grandma a purse, and uh, you know, tell her just go ahead and like that. She's going to go down to the grocery store or whatever tuck it in it's not a problem now the other question I get is a lot of people will say my elderly grandmother has sensitive ears and and if that's the case that's that's why they make suppressors so elderly mother yes I'd go suppressed mini Uzi tuck in the purse tuck go shop wherever any grocery store in any neighborhood that you would be interested in I hope this has been informative I hope this has helped some of you guys and cleared up a lot of those questions I get through my Facebook. Thank you. Night-night.